talk to me, I have a stage name, right? And when people talk to me, they call me by my, my biological name, I'm like, no, it's not that. And then they still do it, but they call it all wrong. So, so let's introduce yourself. Hi guys, I'm Savannah Lee, I'm from Gainesville, Florida, and I'm 24 years old, and I'm a singer. So what inspired you to start singing? So I was definitely inspired by my uncle and my cousin. Um, they both sing opera and musical theater, and my uncle's been overseas and sung with like, I mean, really famous people in Italy. He's been all over the world. Um, he's an amazing singer, and my cousin's an amazing artist. He's in Boston right now. Um, he went to, did like internships at Juilliard. Like, he's amazing. Um, and pretty much um, my grandmother's side, my mom's side, thing, like music runs in the family. And they all played instruments. They all have something to offer in the music industry, in the music world, you know. Um, but to be honest, I just like, it's been really near and dear to my heart before my grandmother passed away. We were not very close. Um, and then I became very close to her when I started singing. So that's what really pushed me to, you know, want to pursue something that I'm passionate about, which is music. So thank you guys. And you are such an amazing singer. Thank you so much. So you teach lessons? No, I wish. <laughs> That'd be fun. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. Give it up, man. We have this young generation that's doing so well in the industry right now. You know, we didn't even think about this when we was growing up. We was thinking about what, as boys, we think about playing with trucks and uh, trucks and climbing trees and everything. We wasn't really thinking about what they're thinking about these days. Mm -hmm. They're so savage of like growing up thinking about what's in the future for me. Yeah. This is amazing. Cause I know I didn't think about it. So, did you think about it? No. Nope. Not at all. <laughs> Not at all. So, I don't know if they're ready. Are they ready? They're close. They're getting close? Uh-huh, they're close. Well, let me tell you what made me do what I do then. Yeah. I guess you want to, y'all want to know that? Well, I'm from, originally I'm from Connecticut. And I came here to Orlando, Florida, because I wanted, it was too cold and the snow, and I was tired of digging out the snow, getting stuck in the house for a week or two, and I couldn't take it no more, so. I didn't want to see no more snow, so I decided to say, hey, I want to see the sun, but it rains so much here. So I don't know if I wanted the rain or the snow. So I decided to take the rain. And I can't drive in rain because it rains all the time and so heavy. So I just take the rain and go really slow and so everybody can blow at me. Say so speed up. And this is what it is. Um, this event is an inspiration. Who, this, who's first time being here? Raise your hand. First time. First time? Come here. No, no. No, no, no. No. A first time. I know I got you already. I'm going to get you. Hi. Tell everybody your name and who you are here with. And who's your model? Your daughter and their names? Um, Angelica Castillo and Lucas Castillo. Okay. So how you like it so far? You like it? Alright, I hope you come back for the next year. Alright. I put you on the spot. Yes, I did. Alright. Alright. I like putting people on the spot. Why not, right? Huh? <laughs> it's evil? I don't think it's evil. I think it's kind of fun to do it. But they don't know what to say when they get on stage. They look at me like, and they be thinking some other stuff. But you know. All right, good name. Okay, I'm Patricia Hardwick. And I'm the grandmother of amazing John John and uh, the little uh, you new reporter queen, Nicole Laura. I'm a retired. Um, Director of Children's Theater for the yeah. City of Reading in California. All right. And uh, I produce plays and shows. Okay. Give her a hand. If you want to act, we know who to go to. She produced plays. So, um, excuse me. I want to be in one of your plays, please. <laughs> you haven't given me out of retirement. Oh. All right. I'll help. You ready? Uh -huh. uh, 
Alrighty then. So, I am super excited for her. She's 13 years old and she. Oh my God. 13? Yeah. I just have one question. I just have one question. Just one question. Does your design come in my size? Yeah, really. They come in all sizes. I'm so mama. That's oh my God. beautiful. 13 years old. Wow. And have her own clothing line. You know how inspiration that is? Can you tell me how you first started? What made you want to do your own clothing line? So I started when I was like about three, four, wow. with helping my grandma like push the pedal on the sewing machine. And then I started getting bullied in the first and second grade. So I took that negative energy and turned it into positive energy by turning it into a fashion line. This is amazing. And you also do something with bullying, correct? Right? Yes. Let them know about that. So I have a company, Bully Chasers, where I go to all types of schools and I tell them what they should do. They see somebody being bullied or they're being bullied themselves. Nice. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Give her a big, big, big hand. When I was 13, I wish I thought about all this because I was see this plan. Why doll babies? But thank you very much. Thank you. Another big round of applause.